So, thank you for being here. I appreciate it. It's a lot better weather today than yesterday. And I am super excited to represent you for District 33. Moved here nine years ago, almost nine years ago, and I've seen nothing but a spiraling downward motion with our current representation. And it's upset me. I have five kids, I'm a husband, and the Boy Scout in me says, leave it better than you found it. So I've decided to stand up and do something about it. I am a real estate professional along with my wife here in Brevard County, and I am a huge supporter of schools, teachers, and we need to get more funding to schools and teachers. And so I want to champion getting that funding from the state level and getting it down to the local level. And it's is super important. <laughs> housing. We need to make sure we are providing affordable housing for everybody. We need to make sure we can get homeless people into shelters. We need to make sure we have that availability and that structure and that support. It's imperative. We need to make sure that we work with the developers in our towns. If they want to put up massive apartments, we need to make sure we are making sure, we need to make sure that we make sure that they create affordable housing within these structures. And it's proven to work. And in the long term, it, it has afforded families the availability to work and not worry about their housing and thus become more productive in our in our communities. So we need to make sure we're working hard on that. I want to champion for far too long, but let me back up. We need people in Tallahassee that are going to work for the people and not for just the few pockets. And with like-minded folks like Ana V. Eskimani and Guillermo Smith and the, the few others that are working super hard in Tallahassee, we need more of that. And I am, I am that bull in the China shop. And I wanna bring those voices to Tallahassee and I wanna fight with them for the people and not just a few. Bravo! And, and so, He who ne shall not be named couldn't gamble in Vegas, and he's not going to be able to gamble with Yance. So, right. thank you. Questions? 